Hey everybody, Travis at MudCreek.com. Today I want to do a review of the Mossy Oak um, shot shell buttstock shell holder. So this is similar to the rifle shell holder except obviously it holds uh, shotgun shells. So you can see here it actually holds five of them. And so you can attach this to the butt of your gun here and I'll show you it on my actual uh, shotgun here in a bit. I just want to show you in the package here um, what it looks like. Pretty basic, it's just a you know, it's a, like an elastic sleeve. You can kind of see there, it's kind of mashy a little bit. But uh, it's just an elastic sleeve. And this is the Mossy Oak brand, but it's also the Allen. They're basically the exact same thing. It's just one's branded under the Mossy Oak. But uh, it's an elastic sleeve that just sits right on your buttstock there. And, uh, you know, and then obviously it has these elastic sleeves for the shells themselves. So this expands a little bit more. And then this is a little bit less so to actually get a shell in there. You know, breaking them in when you're first putting them in, it's a little difficult to put them in here. Let me show you on the actual um, shotgun itself here. So here it is on, this is a Mossy Oak, or I, I apologize, this is a uh, Remington 870 Express here. And uh, you can see how it fits on here. This one's wrapped in cloth, so ignore some of this here. Um, it's just a camel cloth. I uh, did that obviously to camouflage it some, but also um, I just like the look of it a little bit better. I gotta tweak that there, but uh, anyway, um, the only downside with some of these sleeves, and I've talked about this on the rifle one before, but uh, is that they tend to, you know, when this is uh, wood here, it tends to slide a little bit along this where it's cloth. This one doesn't, so that's kind of nice. But you know, if I have one critique where it's kind of a one size fits all approach here. Is it? It's not exact fit to your butt stock, so they have to kind of take a wider approach to this and and try to make sure it can cover as many potential butt socks as it can. So anyway, that's the only downside. So you know, it just stretches on. You can pull it off. You know, slide it off this way, and then put it back on. It's it's a little snug. I mean, that's obviously the idea, but you can see where you get kind of these gaps here. I apologize, my barrel's hitting stuff over there, but uh, um, it doesn't fit perfectly on there, but it's, you know, pretty dang good. And just to have those extra five shells handy, uh, it's really nice. This one's obviously a little dirty. I've used it. Um, but you can see here, shells just pop right in there. And, you know, and they stay in there pretty well. You know, th these ones have sat in there for probably, oh, I don't know. I haven't been duck hunting for a while now. Probably a couple of years just chilling in there. And you can see it hasn't, like lost its elasticity really um, so it's still pretty good uh, first getting them in there the first time it's a little harder but uh, you know they stay in there pretty well like you definitely wouldn't dump it out like this it'd be pretty hard it's not say you couldn't these are 12 gauge shells obviously 20 gauge is gonna be a little smaller it might be a little different haven't tested it out on that yet um, this wouldn't really work for a 410 shotgun what I actually recommend doing is taking I've I haven't personally done it but I know people that have done it they take the rifle one, and I believe it's nine loops in it, and they use the rifle one with the 410 shells. So if you're looking at four, a 410 shotgun, I'd suggest going the rifle route. If not, get this one. Like I said, it's five loops, and it just gives you that, those five extra shells to carry with you that you can have handy, you know, so if you need to get to them quickly, or if you want some different types of shot, you know, like let's say you're deer hunting or something like that, and you want some different buck shots or slugs, this is a great way to have just a few different options on there. You know, if you're not really sure what you're going to do and you want to just have a few different things with you and want to carry this and then you have, you know, whatever you have normally have loaded for, then you have a few extra uh, types on there, maybe a little bit more powerful, a little longer, you know, whatever you need. So anyway, this works pretty well. Um, I highly recommend it. It's a cheap thing. You know, if you're looking for just a cheap accessory for your gun, it's hard to beat this thing. I mean, it really is. Uh, are there better loops out there? Absolutely. But for the money, you know, you're talking probably under 10 bucks on most of these. Um, it's going to work great. So I definitely recommend it for that. So anyway, this is the Mossy Oak. This is the Black Stretch one. Um, and like I said, the Allen brand is basically the exact same thing here. Uh, just a different branding on it. And so uh, come check us out at mudcreek.com. We sell both brands on there. Um, and take a look at them. We appreciate you stopping by and uh, hope this helps you make your decisions.